Who is that? L1 created the first synthetic humans at Sandicorp. He's the one who started this war. That L1? I thought he was dead. Zandique kept trying to recreate him. Most believed he failed. But, after you revived that little girl yesterday, I realized who you really are. Th that's not me! I ran away from Xandacorp! Have you ever wondered why you felt compelled to run? <sighs> <laughs> You're not going to mention how we met, Mona? Zandik and L1 claimed countless lives. I came here to warn Raiden. L1 must be destroyed. I don't like it when you ignore me. Tell me, Mona, why must I be destroyed? Is it because I'm truly dangerous? Or is it simply because you have the power to? And who do you think gave you that power? Glad you came today, Mona. <laughs> Enjoy the view. Yet what the witch did to you. Right in. I... I didn't look at her. And yet you two were the only ones unconscious. Uh, I think I just hit my head. Really hard. <laughs> You're not the only one with mild head trauma. Well, I'm glad you're awake. Mona! Mona, wake up! Please! You have to stop him! I'm surprised the ship's still working in this condition. It's not going to be able to fly on its own. But, I can use it to feed the coordinates to O2 in real time. Right. The coordinates. <laughs> Not that we need them anymore. I see you've returned from your mission. <laughs> so, um, what did you do with the other half of my babies? <laughs> Unfortunately, due to unforeseen circumstances... They're at the bottom of the ocean. Yes. What? 
I see you're the new guy. <laughs> this is somehow your fault. Kave, see to it that RSO3 is taken to the infirmary. I'll be escorting our rogue priestess to my office for interrogation. Right, of course. This isn't over. What? Welcome home, Shogun. Hello, Miko. I see you're on your break, as always. <laughs> Every great novel requires a moment of silence before the next chapter unfolds. I really hope you have a good explanation for all this. Things will become clear soon. I promise. Miko, what are you doing here? I had a feeling I might be needed here. So, here I am. Although I couldn't help but notice, Albedo here didn't seem to recognize the extra bodies he made for me last time. Actually, I do recognize them. And it seems like you've put them to good use. <laughs> yes. With the bodies I have stationed, I can now patrol the city in an instant. I can't thank you enough. And the body you have stored in my office was specifically for security purposes only. Oh? Is that why you requested it? <sighs> but you see, I do take security very seriously. So I'll be scanning your friends for any sign of espionage. you bury this thing earlier, so I fixed it. And, uh, here you go. Uh, I... you? I... I'm L1. You can call me... Albedo. Thank you, Albedo. What are you thinking? He's an ally! That's not L13! The witch is right. You see, L13 never made me extra bodies. I made these myself. What? The person you've been talking to is L1. He's been locked away in L13's mind until now. And he's the Xandacorp spy. <laughs> We have to destroy him before he reports back to Xandacorp. He's already seen too much. Where's L13? <laughs> Let's just say, destroying me will destroy L13. Are you sure you want to do this? Or you can surrender. We have you outnumbered. <laughs> do you really think so little of me, Mona? <sighs> Fine. <laughs> 
Let's get started. <laughs> 